I don't have as much routine in the evening as I do in the morning, but I still do think that having a good night routine is important because if you have a good night routine, then it sets you up for a good morning routine, which then sets you up for a good day. So up until about 6.30, I'll just be working on whatever it is that I was working on that day. Usually I don't have a shower this early as well, but I was quite cold and I'd been on a late run, so I had a shower early today. Um, usually I do this right before bed. Of course it's autumn now and so I do like to light candles. I lit this homemade pumpkin pie scented one today and I was listening to classical music at the same time. Then I went downstairs and I went outside for some fresh air. What's this? <gasps> she had dinner. And then I fed Lola, which I don't always do, but this particular night, mum wasn't here and my mum usually feeds her. Stay. Stay, stay, stay. Stay. Come on. Because my parents were out, I just ate dinner by myself. Um, I had this pea and spinach soup. It was quite flavourless, um, but that's okay. And I turned on Classic FM as well. That's definitely my favourite radio station. My personal favourite composer is Tchaikovsky, quite standard but I think there's a reason that so many people love his work. I also poured myself a glass of kombucha. And then here I am making my dinner. three slices of buttered toast with it. Buttered toast is one of my favourite foods. I just don't think you can go wrong with it. And there's this wonderful line actually in Dodie Smith's I Catch the Castle. I shouldn't think that even millionaires could have something better than fresh bread and real butter and honey for tea. Of course though the butter I'm having is a vegan alternative. And this one is the best one I've tried. Then I went back up to my room and I did some more work. I actually am most productive in the mornings and the evenings. I like to do any heavier tasks then. And here I was just doing the final edits on a poem I've written for a competition and I submitted it as well. Then I tidied my room, closed the curtains and went downstairs to get myself a snack. I like to have a dessert in the evenings. I'd frozen these pastries, like they were Biscoff croissants that I made and I'd frozen some so I just put them in the air fryer. This is my first time air frying frozen pastries and they did not come out all that good. I think I might have to do it in the oven next time but they were still tasty, they just were not as good as I think they would have been in the oven. I also got myself some tea, um, I will have peppermint tea or some kind of herbal tea in the evening. Then I went upstairs and I got into bed and I have recently found Gilmore Girls. Like I started watching it the day before I filmed this video. So this, I was watching the second episode this particular night. I have the attention span for reading, but I just don't have the attention span for watching television. Can't watch like more than one episode at once. So it's gonna take me a very long time to get through Gilmore Girls, but I'm enjoying it. But I do like to watch something in the evenings for between 30 and 45 minutes and to cozy up with some tea. Um, often I'll watch something with my family. 
watching this brings me on to the sponsor of today's video which is NordVPN so I'm sure you've heard me talk about it but NordVPN is what I use if I want to change my VPN address it's the fastest VPN server out there and it gives you access to 5,500 servers in 59 different countries. It's also incredibly easy to change your VPN address. You have this map and you just click on the country that you want to change to. Changing your VPN address basically gives you access to more content and more shows from the streaming sites that you subscribe to because streaming services often have different catalogs for different countries. Changing your VPN address means that you can access these. Gilmore Girls is thankfully on UK Netflix, but I'm traveling elsewhere in Europe soon. And if Gilmore Girls isn't on that Netflix, then I will still be able to watch it, which is amazing. If you've been looking for a way of changing your VPN address, then you can use my link nordvpn.com forward slash ruby. If you use my link, you can get an extra four months on the two year plan. And there is also a 30 day money back guarantee. I watched one episode, as I say, and then I put my laptop away and went to do some skincare. And in the evening while brushing my teeth, I have recently been doing this mini course on how to do cryptic crosswords because I wanted to learn how to do cryptic crosswords for so long now and yet I hadn't taken the steps to actually learn how to do it. It was always just something on the periphery that I thought I want to learn how to do this. I thought I would use my brushing teeth time to do this. So I just go onto the app and it basically just talks you through step by step the different types of puzzle that you might find in a cryptic crossword how to identify them and then gives you examples and uh like questions to test you it's really good and i'd recommend the app once i finish brushing my teeth i usually do get distracted on that app and spend another like five minutes on it we'll get into bed after that properly um all electronics now aside i don't want to go on them the first thing i'm doing here is just noting down things that i accomplished that day so then after that this and this is a very random thing for me to do every night but i do this every night and i maybe for about like 10 15 minutes will do a mind map of ideas for the book that i'm writing at the moment um so any thoughts that i might have been thinking about that evening or that day i can just quickly note down so that my mind is decluttered ready to go to bed but because i often find myself really thinking about this novel whilst i'm going to sleep um and i often get my best ideas down i think in these mini evening mind mapping sessions and then finally of course i read i read every night and um that brings us to the end of my night routine so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i hope that you have a productive week